wherever the St. Cloud State Choir is, we bring our music with us. It comes with the individual and it comes with the group. Being involved with music, being involved with choir, is something that they're able to bring an inspirational aspect of their life into their academic field and someday into their career. By being in the choir, I've had opportunities that I would never have had had I not been involved with music. I guess one of the things that I've really taken from this choir is like the sense of family that we have here. And so I think it's just a really good experience to come to this huge community, but yet when you come into choir, you know everyone by name. I particularly like being a part of the choir because it's so diverse and you learn so much about different cultures and different people, different backgrounds. I think that's something that's really set St. Cloud State apart from the other schools that are out there. My name is Dr. Terry Vermillion and I'm honored to serve as the chairman for the Department of Music. I've come to understand in my 18 years at St. Cloud State University that this is why I became an educator, to make a difference in as many lives as possible. I think that the music faculty here is extremely personable. They're just so helpful and they want you to have the best experience that you can have here. My name is Matt Farrell and I am Acting Director of Choral Activities at St. Cloud State University. We have many ensembles within the music department. On the vocal side, we have men's chorus, women's chorus, concert choir, and chamber singers. The choir is open to any student at St. Cloud State University. And in fact, we pride ourselves that we have many majors represented that are not necessarily music majors. Music isn't my major, it's my passion. This in some ways has become somewhat of a, a slogan for some of us who aren't music majors, but this is why we're here. This is the reason why we've joined the choir and wanted to be part of it. You don't have to be a music major to be part of the choir. About half of our choir is made up of music majors, while the other half is of various majors, and all of them are able to bring something different to the choir. The concert choir board is represented by students within the ensemble. We bring into the choir all kinds of majors, and the board is exactly representative of that. Or you may have a business major serving as treasurer, or a graphics design major serving as a publicity chair. And it really is the board that runs the organizational aspects of concert choir. The choir board essentially serves as the uh, voice for the students, or the voice for the members. Uh, this allows it so that our choir is able to work more efficiently uh, during the school year and especially on tour and during the concerts. A normal choir season can be very busy. Uh, in the fall we have choral connections, music at St. Mary's, and the celebrations of community concert. In the springtime we'll have our Big Sing Festival, uh, high school honor choir festival with a guest clinician, uh, and typically our yearly tour. In some cases those tours have taken to the choir on international trips. The To Be Certain of the Dawn Tour brought a Holocaust oratorio to Germany, France, and Switzerland. After having uh, experienced the To Be Certain of the Dawn Tour and having performed in the Natzweiler Struthof concentration camp, I could travel anywhere in the world and never quite find the opportunity that St. Cloud State was able to offer me through the choir whether it be the musicians and the diversity of the students, all of us coming together with one passion, with one interest, with one love, with one voice. To be part of that tour, and to be part of any tour, we recognize the fact of using music as a way to reach out to other people, as a way of connecting people. Now I'd like to introduce President Earl Potter, President of St. Cloud State University. And so we welcome you, colleagues, neighbors, friends, to celebrate the light with us, this rich tapestry in music and sound. And so I wish for us all that we take the beauty of what you will hear in music this evening into your own lives and share that with others. The world needs it. 
I once had a conductor tell me that music happens when words aren't enough. We may not understand the text, or we may not understand the meaning of the text, but we can still get a sense of the emotion. Being a part of the St. Cloud State Choir has led me to horizons I never imagined. Sing to the